everyone, Laura Beering here, head golf professional at Say Wilo Golf Club at Casino Del Sol. We're talking about alignment today, probably one of the most abused part of golf. So here I'm on a par three. However, you can do this at any tee box. I'm gonna show you how to line up. There's nothing worse than having a great golf swing and then lining up improperly and hitting a crooked shot. I'm on a par three, and you can basically do this on any tee box. Uh, but it's, it's pretty easy to do on a par three because there's lots of divots. All right, so here I have some choices. <clears throat> I'm going to find something that's already in line with the green or close to the hole. In this case, it could be a divot, a broken tee, or an existing clump of grass, maybe from a previous divot. So what I'm going to do is get behind one of these targets and pick the one that's best lined up with the middle of the green. I think I'm going to use the divot. So in this case, I'll get behind, go ahead and set up the golf ball behind that intermediate target, very close, about six inches or, or less to the golf ball. Make sure it's lined up with my target like I thought it was. And to do that, we're always going to get behind the ball. Okay. Then I'm just going to go through my setup routine. I'm going to aim my club face, which is the most important part first, right here at the intermediate target, which is now the divot. Not worried about the hole. Okay, once I'm set up to that divot, let's go ahead and set up the rest of my body. I'm not worried if my body is lined up to the target, because really my body's not hitting the shot. My golf club is. So I want that club face to be aimed at the target, not my body, not my shoulders, not my feet. Everything should be left for a right-handed golfer. So my body's aimed left, my club is aimed at the target. Now I'm just ready to swing. Take the time to line up properly. You'll save a lot of strokes. <laughs> 